Hi everybody. Well, I thought I'd make a little video about a receiver dryer. And this is actually a cutaway that we use for, uh, use as a prop for some of our training classes. So, I wanted to talk about it real quick, the parts, what it does, how it works. Um, basically, there's an input and an output, and then a big aluminum can. And you can see there, there's an arrow indicating the flow direction for the refrigerant. So refrigerant would come in through this side, go through the receiver dryer, and then come out through this side. And let's take these caps off real quick. You can see what the ports look like. Yeah, it's just a threaded connector with a hole. And yeah, nothing special. So anyway, take it apart. That's it. Just a big empty aluminum can. But it's really what happens on here is to how the receiver dryer works. So if refrigerant comes in here, what happens is it comes in, goes down, and then comes out through that little hole right there. And then the refrigerant has to pass through this set of screens and filters. And also in here would be desiccant, uh, which is the little desiccant beads that we've seen before. Um, we actually have some in some other videos we have online if you want to see them. Um, and then it comes down through this bottom set of filters and then it would just sit inside the can. And then you can see here there's a hole in the bottom of this tube so it's kind of like a pickup tube. And then the refrigerant would flow, get sucked up the tube and then up through here and then out through that port right there. Um, so it's pretty cool, not a whole lot to it, you know, but still all in all, pretty ingenious design. And then what it does is, there's two names, it's a receiver and a dryer. So the receiving part, this acts as a storage unit to hold refrigerant while the system is running. And then the dryer part is where these filters and the desiccant come in because the refrigerant passes through it and gets cleaned and dried before it moves on and goes down through the system. So, it's pretty cool. If you have any questions or any comments, please post them below. And thanks a lot for watching.